We get a lot of people asking us branded relating questions, so I thought I'd try to answer a couple or a few a month. So I've got this one from Jane Horrock in Wigan. What would be the point of branding my little small florist upon the high street? Well said, Jane. But it was once said that a small business owner, all they needed to be successful was a business card, a yellow pages ad and a decent product. And I think this has stuck with some people. If I build it, they will come! And that just won't cut it anymore. Now you need a logo, a website, marketing collateral, flyers, social and so much more. Branding ensures that your message to customers is consistent and clear throughout all of these. Part of the brand building process we help with is creating clever marketing and advertising strategies to entice customers not only to just buy ones from you, but again and again. We basically build fans for your business. I can hear you now, Jane, from behind your daisies. But I can't afford to do branding. Actually, Jane, you can't afford not to. With so much competition in your local high street, you need to make yourself stand out. Even now, with a simple Google search, I can see you have a hell of a lot of competition in Wigan. Why the frig should I get my flowers from you and not wildflowers are at the top of Google search? Sure, branding can get incredibly expensive, only if your idea of branding is a nationwide television and print campaign, but it doesn't need to be. You'd be surprised that some of the range of services and affordable our branding packages are, Jamester. Why not get in touch? Just give us a bell. Go and check out another one of our videos on what is branding and that'll give you a bit more of a detailed insight. But for now, goodbye, Jane. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye, Jane. Goodbye, Jane. Good.